Okay, hi, what's your name? Todd, Todd Gruel. Todd Gruel, how do you spell it? G-R-U-E-L. G-R-U-E-L, okay. And what do you do, Todd? Um, well, I, I help people. I have two part-time jobs, one working with kids at a daycare center, and uh, the other one mentoring people with disabilities, so autism, Asperger's, that wow. sort of thing. Wow, okay. Um, and you know why you're here today? Yeah, um, I, I know why, on, on your half, as, as far as your uh, motive, well, as much of it was disclosed um, uh, for the project, but uh, I'm, I'm here because I was searching on Craigslist for some opportunities to make a little, little bit of something, a little bit of money, Okay. so the intersection. Have you ever done anything like this before? No. Okay. So do you know what do you know what you want to accomplish today? Um, I would like to explore anger in a way that is uh, expressive and and uh, personally rewarding, but safe as well. It's uh, I guess it's ironic. I've, over the last few weeks, I've been thinking about anger. Uh, philosophically and um, the role that it plays for the person and um, so it, I, this, this project seems appropriate for my own recent quest. Do you feel like we need it somehow? Anger? I, I think so. I, I think um, the analogy that comes to mind for me is it's a little bit like a painter's um, palette. Uh, the, the same fundamental colors are used and recycled, but modified according to need and context and the personality in question. So they might be combined in a way to create a new dynamic, but fundamentally we all use and harness uh, same array of emotions. I think, just like fear, I think anger has an important role, um, a survival purpose, if used carefully, of course. Uh, it could be an indication or a warning that something's wrong and um, that there's an issue that's overripe that needs to be addressed. Right. So how we choose to apply it is our... Exactly. It could, it could be it could be destructive, it could be self-destructive, or it could be um, beneficial to the individual and um, anybody else in question, friends, family, etc. Is there anything in particular you're angry about? Yeah, yeah, plenty. Um, the current economy and the difficulty in finding a job. I mean, it's my criteria at, at the very least, something that's uh, rewarding with some redeemable value. And um, friends, family, um, uh, money, a lack of it, and even myself, really. Uh, things I've, I've done wrong, things I could do better, but I'm not brave enough to address or accomplish yet. So, all those, I suppose. It's a pretty heavy list. Yeah, yeah, it's it's thick, it's yeah. thick. But I, I'm, I'm I'm still young, I suppose. As long as I'm forging onward and and making some progress, uh, I I can be patient. Okay. Well, um, what we'd like to do is have you work out some of these frustrations on the, the bag. Um, it's all about you, and there's no there's no set rule. Uh -huh. So if you hit it once and you feel satisfied, that's fine. Yeah. If you want it completely covered, that's fine. Yeah. Whatever you want to do, I have a, a bat. If you feel you need extra, yeah, know. I think I might definitely pull that out. Okay. Uh, I guess I'll just keep on swinging, flailing, and thrashing to the point of absurdity. Yeah, until you feel better. That's all we want. So. If you don't, if you don't feel better, um, keep going.
going. Okay. So basically, I'm I don't have any I don't have any goals, uh, any guidelines. So I don't I don't care how it looks. I care how you feel. So I want you to okay, work out whatever it is you need to do. Okay. And if you want another color, that's fine too. And you know, two colors is not your limitations. So okay. If you go ahead. All right. Pick whatever you want. Good. Yeah. Got some more in you and you're done. I think I'm done. All right. It's good. I come this way. How did that feel? Oh, that was great. Looks pretty good. I like it. Thank you. Interesting colors. Looks it looks uh pretty powerful. Let's go ahead and uh, take it down. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.